Yo, what's up, YouTube? This is Gemmerit coming to you today with a brand new video, boys. And today, we're going through and opening up nine Team of the Season packs. So let's get right into the video. So guys, welcome to another video on the channel. And today, guys, we are opening up nine guaranteed Team of the Season packs from the tree, guys. So obviously, we've had coin packs that we've opened for each of the leagues for team of the season and we had some extra points so we are just going to go through and I uh, use some of these vouchers uh, just to get up to eight points for each of the leagues so that we can go through and complete up until the node that gives you the elite player guys let's hope that we can actually pack a master so many people have packed masters from them uh, but I wanted to do sort of a combination video where I went through and opened up all six leagues in one video we are also, guys, going to jump onto my mini account where we have got three more leagues to do. Um, we already have done a few of them um, just off camera. We didn't pull anything all that great. Um, but like I said, guys, I've seen so many people pull masters uh, from the event. So I thought, you know, why not? I'm just going to do it, see what my pack luck is like, and hopefully somehow pull a master. That would be absolutely crazy. So also, guys, as you can see, we are on around 730-ish uh, points or vouchers. We are pretty much saving them. We're just doing a video today uh, because I wanted to always do this video. Um, we did this last year as well. I did really enjoy it. Um, so I'm just going to see sort of what, what we can get, guys, because you never know. Um, and it is something that I do enjoy doing because we don't really have that many packs, uh, or as many packs anyway, uh, this season when comparing it to last season. So we're just going to go through and jump onto the completion of the trees and then go from and there. And here we are, guys, starting off with Community Tots. So obviously, um, the pool that we would want to get is preferably the Courtois or the Sergio Busquets. None of them are really worth it, uh, but let's see what we can get in this. Now, also guys, a lot of people have been asking me what I'm doing with my vouchers. As you can see, I still haven't spent them really. The only time I've spent them is now. This is literally the first time that I'm, I'm spending them. Um, just because I think that if you opened up the coin packs, you may as well go and convert a few vouchers uh, to get yourself a, you know, pretty much a free elite, guys, you know, in many instances. So if you did open up the coin packs, I'll definitely recommend, uh, you know, doing this because, you know, you could pull a, three, a card worth 3 million coins. You never know. So let's jump into the first one. This is probably uh, the least exciting one due to the fact that there is no uh, master in the community tots. So let's see what we get. What's it going to be? It is going to be Robertson, guys. He does actually look like a decent card at left back with the Compose boost. He's had such a great season uh, for Liverpool as well. Very, very good player in real so life. Left backs are always going to have a relatively high price attached to them. Having said that, though, left backs have actually dropped quite significantly um, due to team of the season. There's been so many left backs. There hasn't been that many right backs, guys. Um, so that's something that's very, very interesting. Um, the, the tides are sort of turned because initially, you know, right backs were really cheap with Lindelof, but now there hasn't been as many right backs uh, in Team of the Season, but more so left backs. Moving on to Team of the Season, uh, Premier League, guys, English Premier League. We've got, obviously, Sun and Lukaku. I wouldn't be too mad with uh, Sadio Mane or Roberto Firmino. And as Quetta looks like a really solid card as well. So let's go through and jump into the skill game. Let's hope we can clutch it out, guys. I'd be so happy if we pulled that uh, that Sun. Although, a lot of people have been telling me that although he is a fantastic card and he plays really, really uh, well in-game, the Guedes, the 85 overall Guedes from uh, La Liga team of the season is actually a fantastic card. So, let me know your thoughts on the best left mid in the game. Who do you guys enjoy the most? Who do you guys use? A lot of people do use that Guedes and are saying that he is absolutely fantastic, as well as Sun. Let's jump into this pack, guys. Let's see what we're going to get. Are we going to pull a master? We are not, and we get Pope, guys. That's probably the worst possible pull, but still, I'll take it. You know, it's going to be either useful for SBCs, or potentially, I'll just sell him uh, in the future. Now, guys, what we're going to be doing is just going through and having a look at the La Liga. So we need to go through and do the same skill event once again. So obviously, in this instance, guys, there's four potential masters, the Suarez. Diego Godin, Isco, and Sergio Busquets. I actually packed our Diego Godin on my mini account on a coin pack, which was just absolutely sublime. That was such a sick pull. I was so happy about that. Did you guys manage to pack any masters from the coin packs? Let me know in the comment section down below. 
Also guys, um, I'm wondering if you do enjoy uh, the player reviews. Do you want me to continue to do player reviews? I mean, obviously I'm not an expert with players, but I'm, I'm trying to sort of give you my best opinion on them. And I do really enjoy sort of testing out, um, you know, players for you guys to give you my opinion on them. And it is my opinion, guys. It's not necessarily, you know, the 100% truth, like in terms of it might not suit you and it might uh, go against what you think, but that's just my opinion on the player. And obviously it is on my mini account, so it's definitely much harder to get a proper idea of what they're like because my mini account is pretty much just for testing purposes. But let's jump into this pack, let's see what we get. Can we get something huge? We, once again, do not get a master. But guys, we do get uh, Sergio Roberto. Like I was saying before about right backs, he's pretty much one of the only cheaper ones, even though he is relatively expensive. I'll take that pull, um, I'm happy about that. Now guys, we've got a few of the nodes to go through and complete uh, in the Bundesliga. So I'm just gonna speed this portion of the video up and I'll come back to you once we're up to here. And just going through and completing up the final event before we get on to the next event, guys, for a guaranteed Bundesliga player. Let's hope that we can clutch it out in this one because there are some nice masters, especially uh, that Royce, guys. I'd like to really test them out in a video for you guys. Um, also, the Narbury as well. I'm thinking about doing a video with him. Let me know in the comment section down below uh, if you guys want to see that. So let's go through and jump into this. Nabri is actually really expensive, so if I pull him, I'll be happy with that. He's like 800, 900k. I mean, it's because he's got really, really good shooting stats. Um, and, I'm uh, not shooting stats, sorry, uh, really insane acceleration. Um, he does look like a beast, guys. He really does. A lot of people have been uh, using him. Let me know in the comment section down below if you guys have used uh, Nabri. Um, and what's he like, guys? Have you trained him up? And how much, if so, have you trained him up to? Very interested to know about that because, like I said, he looks absolutely insane. So let's go through and open up this pack. Let's hope guys, let's hope that we get something big. What's it gonna be? Is it gonna be a master? It's not. It's gonna be Pedersen guys. Not the greatest of pulls to be honest. Um, so far our pack like hasn't been the greatest. We are finally gonna move on to League Un and Kautscher A Serie A. So we've gotta do the same uh, with League Un and Kautscher A. So I'll be right back uh, once we have reached that node again and then we'll go from there. And taking a look at some of the options guys. So obviously Mbappe, Thiago Silva would be fantastic. That variety card as well would sell for a decent amount of coins just because it is a center mid and center mids are still scarce. Also this Aqua card guys, he was an absolutely fantastic card um, in Freeze if you guys do remember. I think his stats aren't as good as maybe what they were, I don't know, I haven't checked but I just remember when that Freeze Aqua came out, his stats were absolutely sublime. He was very very quick uh, and probably one of the better center mids potentially in the game at that time. I can't quite remember but I just remember guys, he was really really quick. He does have um, some decent speed in this card, but still, for me guys, I like to look uh, preferably for shooting stats because that's what I feel um, does help me more at the end of the day. Obviously, speed and dribble is very, very important, um, but I feel as though um, shooting is probably a bit more important. That's just for me. A lot of people do love to just, you know, swipe, um, you know, easier goals and use the pace of a player to get past the defenses, but that's just sort of the, the stuff that I like to do anyway. Jumping onto this pack guys, let's see what we can get. Are we gonna get anything big? Are we gonna get that master that we've been looking for? What's it gonna be? It's going to be Variety. Okay, that's actually not a bad pull guys. I'm happy about that. I'll take that any day of the week. Let's just have a look at his stats. So he's got really bad shooting stats. Jumping onto the final one for the day guys and then onto my mini account. And guys, finally we are going to go through and complete this one for the couch show A. So obviously I'd love to pull Douglas Costa. Uh, great, great card. I feel as though he's the best right winger in the game. Nine as well looks like an absolute beast, as well as obviously Murdens, who is relatively expensive. Um, there are some pretty average ones, uh, however. But still, guys, let's hope that we can uh, pull it out and get something big in this final pack on our main account. And then, guys, what we're going to be doing is just going through and uh, testing it out on our mini account. We've got, I think, three leagues to do. We've got Bundesliga. Uh, League on as well as Couch A. So hopefully we can get some sort of luck there. If not, oh well, that's just the way that it is. So needing to just hit one more target and then we can finally see what we get. Oh boy, I'm excited guys. I really am excited because if we pull that Douglas Costa guys, I might actually switch to Diamond on my main account. If not, oh well. Let's see. Oh boy. Who's it going to be guys? What's it going to be? It's not going to be a master unfortunately. It's going to be Illicic. So not the greatest of pack luck, although I'm not going to be mad about it guys, you know, they're pretty much free elites that everybody can get. And just quickly going through and opening up the one for the Bundesliga on my mini account. What's it going to be? 
we do get uh, Thorgan Hazard there, guys. So not the greatest of pulls. I'm just going to go through and jump onto League Un now. And here's League Un's pack, guys. Can we get a master on our mini account? Who's it going to be? It's not going to be a master. It's going to be Mariano, guys. Not the greatest of pulls. Although he does look like an okay card, I suppose. Um, jumping into the couch here, eh? And then ending off the video. And just completing off the live event one last time, guys, on the mini account. This is pretty much going to be the end of the video for today. Um... Very, very hyped about World Cup. Obviously, by the time you're watching this, it may be released on console already. Uh, it's due on the 29th and obviously on FIFA Mobile on the 6th of June. Let's see what it's going to be. What do we get, guys? We do get illicits, unfortunately. But other than that, it's going to be the end of the video for today. Thank you all for everything and peace.